and I found uh, Jasmine to uh, be of very high quality as far as their models go. Yeah. And, uh, and so I, uh, I engage in a very, very select few, but mostly for the socialization. It's, it's a cordiality. I enjoy the, the, the back and forth. Uh, the communication? You know, a little bit of um, informal banter, if you will. Absolutely. Okay, if you could put into one word your favorite thing about Jasmine, what would it be? Quality. Oh, that's nice. Uh, the model quality. Well, you have many, many to choose from, and I'm very, very selective. Very. You mentioned a moment ago that the main reason you use Jasmine is for socialization. Mm-hmm. What is it about Jasmine that gives you that social aspect? Is it the chatting, the communication, the friendship? What is it? Mm, mostly all of that, all of the above. It's, uh, it's, it's, it goes by the individual model. Uh, I'll put them on, on a list and uh, interact and, uh, and see how they respond. And... Uh, if we mentally can meet, yeah, I'll tip her. I'll take her private. But even in private, it's so how's your life been? Yeah. You know, kind of stuff. <laughs> Isn't that so funny? I think that's something that a lot of people don't realize about live jasmine is that. Um, I think they just assume that everything that happens on Live Jasmine is uh, sexual. And it's like so much of it actually isn't, right? Precisely. Yeah. That, that's what I find most attractive about the site. And you have a very wide selection of models to choose from, but then I'm very selective as well. So Celia is an amazing hostess. Yes, yeah, she recommended you for this interview and I would love to talk about your relationship with her. It goes back a year and a half maybe. Uh, we've done some private stuff, playing around, um, but very cordial. Um, I enjoy just the interaction. She recognizes me. She knows my habits, my uh, uh, inclinations. And so we can talk suggestively in a very clever way. <laughs> mm. Do you feel like she, it sounds like you feel like she understands you. Yes. I just stop you and say, hi, how you doing? <laughs> Listen to her. She makes a very good radio show. I, that's what I've heard. Yes, very good. I mean, I can just take a nap, go to sleep at night. I, I, in, fact, <laughs> in fact, I slept. Uh, I, I took a private and slept on once and fell asleep at least once, if not once. If you could put into one word your favorite thing about Little Red Bunny, what would it be? Cordiality. She's a very pretty gal but, and is very <laughs> um, um, flexible <laughs> if you've watched the show. But uh, cordiality, social ability, what I'm looking for. Is Jasmine your favorite campsite? I always come back to it. I've tried others, but uh, I know when I, I know that I come back always. I always come back to Jasmine for whatever reason. I don't know. It's just familiar with it, and it's a very nice site. Do you feel like the socialization that you've been able to get from Jasmine has helped? has helped you get through different 
times in your life? I would say yes, at my age. Do you feel like you've made stronger connections on Jasmine, like with Little Red Bunny, as opposed to some of the connections you have in your day-to-day life? To the extent of the medium, yes, given my uh, preferences, it's extremely difficult to achieve that. But yeah, I would say, I would say Jasmine is uh, overall been an improvement. You know, online platforms, including social media platforms like Jasmine have really helped to keep all of us connected in a day and age where it's harder to be well, that is that is true. Uh, now, bearing in mind that I was a professional engineer, I helped build the internet. And now you're benefiting from your work, your Precisely. life's work. Precisely. Well, you, you right now, you are relying on um, a piece of technology that uh, I helped standardize. Incredible. You don't even know about it because it's buried so damn deep into your operating system that you'll never know it's there. But we know it's there because we put it there. Very cool. What a cool thing to be part of. It took took me four years to to make that happen. I like to end the interviews by asking one final question, which is just what's something in your life you're the most grateful for right now? But number one is the family. Beautiful. Certainly for me, my age, my experience. Beautiful. I love that. Well, thank you so much for giving us your time and sharing your experience and and, uh, the highlights for you with Little Red Bunny and uh, Jasmine. We really appreciate it. 